Bonjour everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm the Thrifty Native, or you can call me Stephanie, whatever you prefer. So I have a huge haul of some items that I found from the Goodwill outlet section. If you don't know what that is, it's kind of like a last chance place to find some things that didn't sell for thread up or they just didn't accept or something like that. Anyways, the more you buy, the bigger discount you get. I think the max discount is 40% off if you buy 20 or more items. And that's what I did. So this is, I think a purchase of two different times, but I bundled them together. because they have that weird bundle function or feature. So I already started listing these items. So hopefully they're up by the time I release this video out into the wild. So I'm gonna jump right into it because my son will probably be waking up soon. So, uh, yeah. Here we have uh, Anthropology, Ari and Ally, new tag, black, long sleeve top, and it has pretty little eyelet detail there. This is my pile of stuff that I need to put away. I just got done photographing it, so. Puella, size medium. A little swing top. This is also new with tags. It's retail for $68. And it has a nice little ruched sleeve. Love the colors. I needed more jeans. So I was really looking for jeans. Here we have Urban Outfitters BDG cropped pull on with the side zip here. Pant. These are a size four. I got this based on style. I just thought it was adorable. I don't know what it says. Tres Jolie? Tres Jolie? I don't know, it's French. Uh, it's a loft size medium, short sleeve, stretchy top. We have another pair of Urban Outfitter pants. These are size 27. These are definitely like vintage style. Um, jogger type pant, 100% cotton. We'll see how well these do. They had a ton of likes. Eva Franco, which sold at Anthropology. I thought it was just sold at Anthro, but I don't know if this specific piece was sold at Anthropology. Um, but it is new with tags and it's cute. And perfect for spring and summer. For some shorts, these are American, no, not American Eagle. Abercrombie and Fitch. They're size 27, any high rise shorty. Cute little striped print and then um, raw hemp. Another new with tag item this is Airy, which is American Eagle. This is a swimsuit, it says Best Babes. And there's padding, and this is a size large. Um, this is also called the High Cut Cheeker, uh, and it retailed for 50 bucks. So it's, it has that one shoulder. Uh, another Anthropology item. I thought this was cute. I love the mixed print. Patchworky looking top. Should do well in spring. Won't get a ton, but I think my average cost of good was just below $6. Um, Weston, which is sold at Anthropology. This is new with tags. Um, I don't know if this specific piece was sold at Anthro because it only has a Weston tag. So, and it has a cool little texture to it. I love this piece. This is another Urban Outfitters, which I don't typically pick up, but this was just too adorable. It's a cute little daisy print mini dress. It has a little V-neck there in the front with some buttons. In the back, it has a buckle. This is a size six and the brand is Cooperative. So I'm excited to sell that. Another new tag, this is Metal Roo. Pretty little tank. Um, there is a flaw with this item. This is a size small. A little bit of it has the stitching came apart. So hopefully somebody can fix that because I don't want to do it. Another Urban Outfitters item. What's going on? Hopefully these sell. It's a bodysuit. Bodysuits typically do pretty well for me. And this is new with tags, so I'm hoping that will help itself faster, but it retailed for $36. This is the Out From Under, size small. Out From Under typically sells faster for me than all the other sub-brands that they have at Urban Outfitters. So 
fingers crossed. This is Pure and Good, which sold at Anthropology, but this piece was not. But it has an anthro care tag. So it's Marshalls. I was a little bummed when I saw that when I got it, but I think it'll still sell. It's cute. Little peplum style. This is so adorable. This new tags, Dolan. Uh, cheetah leopard print top. Yeah, I don't think it's off the shoulder. It's a size small. New tags. It's a pretty thick cotton too. So excited to list that. New a tag Mave. And the main reason I got this was because it's a large. I don't find a lot of large anthropology. This is just a pretty basic lightweight tank. But when I was photographing it, I noticed there was a little bit of a flaw, but I think it'll wash out if somebody washed it. I'm not going to just because um, it's new with tags. So hopefully somebody will still buy it. <clears throat> Another new with tag, Dolan, stretchy three quarter length sleeve top and it has a ruffle trim. This is a size small and it retailed for 78 bucks. I love selling this brand. This is J. Jill Love Linen, specifically their Love Linen line. It's a, uh, crap, what is what is this print called? Plaid? But what kind of plaid? Check? I don't remember. Anyways, it's 100% linen, boxy, oversized fit, and size small. This is probably one of my favorite pieces that I found. This is Zara, extra small, definitely oversized. Love the polka dots. It has a balloon sleeve and this is I think a, a newer Zara label. So and the, the polka dots are like a 3D furry fur ball. <laughs> uh, extra small. I don't know if I said that. There is no inner tag so I don't know what this is. Hopefully I can find more online about it when I list. Um, it feels like rayon. Comps looked pretty good or decent enough for me to buy. <laughs> Kukai, size zero. I don't know if they have their own sizing or not. I don't remember because I ordered these things quite a long time ago. It has a cute little chunky knit cardigan. Nice cream color and this is wool. That is the main reason I got it. A wool acrylic alpaca. Okay, I mainly got this and I'm a little disappointed that I got this, but it's made well, extra small don't sell made well that well. I got it because it's not your average plaid print. It kind of has like this bleeding effect, like the color bleeding. I just thought it was so cool and unique, but they have like these blue little stains. I don't know. I'm, I might try to get them out. We'll see. I don't know. I like selling this brand, the COS or COS. This is a size medium. Nice little burgundy wine color, long sleeve. And I liked the, the hems, they're like raw cut. And this is a cashmere blend, I think. I remember. Let's see. Oh, uh, Lyo sell wool. Just kidding, no cashmere to be found, but it is wool. Nice color. Tolani is an extra small, 100% silk, little faux wrap top, blouse with elastic sleeves. This, this is another really nice piece, this is Zara, but there is a flaw, but it's absolutely beautiful. It kind of reminds me a little bit of Johnny Was. Lots, lots of keywords here, embroidered floral details and Swiss dot. Ruffle trim, peplum, and it has a nice little button back. This is a size small. And the only flaw is this tiny little stain down here. I'm hoping that it will still sell. If not, honestly, I might wear it myself. Um, it's a beautiful color, nice mustard yellow. I know, I know I said I don't sell this brand well, but comps on this specific style looks pretty decent. It's made well, extra small, little butterfly top, 
it's a thick knit uh, cotton um, yeah that's pretty much it <laughs> love me some animal print cheetah print this is a wool skirt by velvet which can be sold at anthropology I'm not positive if this one has I'll let you know once I look it up but it's stretchy let's see where is the tag size medium this is a oh it's not wool it's cashmere nylon viscose polyester cashmere spandex Whew, there's a lot of different fabrics in there but my favorite print something navy uh this is an extra small ribbed uh knotted front yes a knot front long sleeve top this is like a orange it looks like it's showing up more red viscose nylon polyester cashmere I absolutely love this. I might wear it a few times. The last item that I got to photograph today is this Banana Republic Extra Fine Merino Wool, size small, little embroidered sweater. Trebian, I think that's how you say it. If I learned anything from Wiggles, it's I've learned a little bit of French. <laughs> Trebian, Trebian, I think that's how they say it. 100% uh, merino wool, and this was from summer of 2019. I absolutely love this sweater. I think the leaves, the, the leaves, the length of the sleeves are not quite full, so a nice spring staple. Blue and gray, I love this fun cardigan. You just pull over, easy to wear, and this is wool. Mohair, nylon, wool, acrylic nice neutral easy to match with colors i got this because i know somebody will buy this it's ribbed uh knit with faux fur collar this is acrylic wool polyester pretty sure this is faux wool faux uh, it doesn't say i'm guessing this is where the wool is but short sleeve Pretty cool. You will notice a lot of Zara. These are items that I need to photograph on my mannequin, so, or either on the wall. I've been doing lay flats, so I've been able to photograph faster. Anyways, okay, so this is a Zara 100% silk dress. I did not know they had 100% silk stuff. Size small, just a fun little popover dress, if that's how to describe it. Oh. The votes are in. Did I win the chili contest? My husband has an annual chili cook-off, and I make it every year. I've been trying to win these past three years. Apparently, the boys over there like it spicy, so I spiced it up. Yes, 100% silk and 100% polyester lining. So we'll see if I win. I so I definitely made it a lot more spicier than I usually do, but it turned out really, really good. Banana Republic um, cardigan, size small, sleeveless cardigan. This is a wool nylon alpaca spandex. Mohair nylon wool. Oh wait, did I already say that? I don't know but I really liked the construction of this. It's really cute. It would be really, really cute with a uh, black long sleeve underneath. All right, how fun is this <laughs> little mini dress? It's from Zara. It has a bunch of uh, embellishments. It has beads, embroidery, just super cool all over. This is a size medium. This looks like a pretty old tag too, so. Yeah, I gotta put this on a mannequin or something. Mm. Here we have a dress. Yeah, a cold shoulder short sleeve dress. This is soft surroundings, size medium. It has some nice little pockets there on the side. And I believe this is linen. I don't typically pick this brand up a lot. Yes, linen rayon. Um, but I liked it, so, oh, did I win? I don't know, 
pop up yet. Here we have a nice little vintage sweater with some embellishments, some beading. I just thought it was adorable. Crew neck. This is lamb's wool angora rabbit hair and nylon. Peter Valentine. So I don't know how well this will do, but I got a base soft style. I just thought it was adorable. I gotta see if I won. Okay, keep going. Comps on this looked really, really promising. This is a really cute mauve pink color. This is Lily Aldridge. I'm not even sure who that is, but it's for Velvet Graham and Spencer. It's a little collab that she did with them. It's size small, 100% cotton. I don't remember exactly what the comps were going for on online. I'll show it over here, but yeah, this is a really nice lightweight jacket. Perfect for spring. Um, I got this based on style and fabric content, and if it didn't sell, honestly, I would wear this. I think this is adorable. A little chunky knit v-neck sweater. The brand is Cliché Couture. I have no idea where this is sold, but it's an extra small. And it is a acrylic wool. So I just liked the color blocking little funness there. So we'll see how well this does. My husband loves to tease me. Oh my God, come on, hurry up and answer me. This is Layla's. I don't know where this is sold, but it's a fun little oversized sweater. What size was this? Small, medium. I think this is a wool blend. I mainly got all these things because they were wool. Acrylic wool, so chunky knit. Be cute with a black long sleeve under it. I think my, my son is waking up, so I gotta hurry up. This is Unique Glows, a cute little cardigan, long duster line, long line, extra small. I think it's new without tag because it still has that barb in there, but absolutely adorable. I would keep it, but I think this is a little too long for me. I'm too short. It's acrylic, nylon, cotton wool. Beautiful color. I actually got this for myself. Lazy mood, am I right? Yes. All right, size small. I'm putting it over there. All right. The main reason why I bought all these things was because of this. This is Zara. I told you there's a lot of Zara. Look at these sleeves. Nice embroidery uh, jacket. This is in really nice condition. I absolutely love this. I was waiting. I waited maybe an hour for the cart timer to expire because it was in someone's cart and I was like, hurry up and buy it or hurry up and take it out of your cart so I can buy it. Finally, the time expired, so I was able to snag this, but this is so cute. This is a size small. Really hoping this does, does really well. One of my favorite brands to sell, Wooden Ships. Here's the tag and you can find the stuff underneath. Uh, medium acrylic mohair wool, which I think typically their stuff is wool or mohair. So pretty little striped sweater. Another Zara, it's a little wool jacket. I like the, the sleeves, nice little fun moment going on there. This is a size small, single button. This would be really, oh no, I think there's a belt. <laughs> but it didn't come with a belt, so, hmm. Hopefully it still sells, I don't know now. All right, comps on this looked really good too. I think this is sometimes sold at Anthropology. I think this was sold at Anthropology. I could be wrong. Extra small, um, Sherpa jacket. This is full zip up. Nice little neutral cream color with a dark, no, this is like a blue, a dusty blue gray and black trim. So yeah, we'll see how well that does. Here we have Gap. This is one size. Poncho, what's that? Uh, poncho cardigan. 
back to the colors and it's a wool blend. Oh, this one fell off the hanger. Oh, okay, almost done. Uh, Fever, which is, I don't know where it's sold, but it's a wool blend and it's hooded, size small. A little cardigan. This is another favorite. I like polka dots, can you tell? This is blue and gray for loft, extra small. I've never seen this tag, so it makes me think maybe this is a newer piece. But it's oversized for sure. Look at these dots. Aren't they so cute? You see that? They're like different colored. Um, yeah, this is an excellent condition. I don't think it's been worn. Of course, it's a wool blend. My arm is killing me. Uh, acrylic nylon wool spandex. I'm excited to list this. Another Gap cardigan, wool blend, I'm sure. Has some fringe here on the side. It's just a nice little cozy sweater. It's a size small. Okay, so these next couple of pieces I may keep for myself, I need to try them on. Uh, I don't know what this brand is. Ego-ish? Probably Boutique. Uh, but it's a small, new tag. Kind of looks like a cow print almost, but it's dotted or spotted. Lightweight top. And then this cute little flutter sleeve top. This is Kim and Cami. Size like small, so... I might wear this a few times. I don't know how it's gonna look on me, so. Found a nice little dress. It's floral, satin. Uh, this is from Urban Outfitters. It's a size medium. It retailed for $459. It's kimchi blue. Has a little tie back there. Lightweight. Hurts. Oh, okay, left to center from Anthropology. Little tunic top. This is a size small. Another anthro piece, size medium. I just thought it was adorable. Super stretchy. It'll probably sit for a little while, but worth it. It's so cute. All right, we have this really cute Zara Trafalic dress. It's a size extra small, but definitely oversized. It's kind of reminded me of Ariana Grande, how she wears those like baby doll tops with no pants. Um, so this is definitely a, a mini length dress. Maybe I'll, no, I'm not gonna keep it. No. Another really fun, uh, Zara piece. Look at that embroidery on the sleeves. It's really, really nice. This is a size extra small. Wow, that is definitely oversized. <laughs> nice little deep V there. Um, yeah, I mainly got it because of these sleeves. I don't know, maybe this is a dress. I thought it was a top, but now I'm thinking it's probably a dress. You could wear Either a cami underneath or a nice little sexy bralette. Mm. That will definitely bring some boys to your, your yard. Ah. All right. I just sold something from this brand. This is Three Dots. This is a, a uh, I think a cashmere blend, but it has some cute little polka dot panels there. Super stretchy. See, what are you? Silk viscose spandex, extra small, three dots. Ah, oh, but there looks like there's a stain right here. Wonder if I can get that out. I don't know. That up's usually pretty good if you tell them things were not as described. So I might return this. Okay, we have a nice little fun mint green dress, swing dress, super strappy. This is a, a sample piece from Urban Outfitters, 
size small or it retailed for I think it was on sale for $20 anyways so yeah perfect for spring and summer has pleated uh it's pleated yeah this this was an oopsie buy I thought these were Hudson because they were under assorted brands skinny um pregnancy pants as you can tell but they are not they are h&m so i'm still gonna try to sell them they don't sell and they're going to my uh sister-in-law maybe i don't know they're size eight mama's skinny but they look a lot smaller than that to me i don't know i don't know what i'm doing with these yet Okay, I don't normally pick this brand up, but this was just way too cute. This is Philosophy Size Small. I don't even know where this brand is sold at. I just know I don't pick it up. But look at this. Look at these cute little, what are these? Peonies? Daisies? I don't know. Cute flowers. And it's an acrylic wool blend. Oh, absolutely adorable. Oh, oh yeah. I won the chili cook-off. I won. Not that I win anything, but I got those bragging rights now. <laughs> that makes me happy. Okay, the comps on this looked really, really good. And look how fun this is. This is really, really fun. I don't pick this brand up. In fact, I don't pick this up at all because I've gotten it in Jomar boxes and they, it has just been sitting. But the comps look pretty promising on this. This is a size four. Anything else? Uh, it's just 100% cotton. With a large button up there. So we'll see. It's really cute. Love linen by J. Jill, size medium, maxi dress. 100% linen. Cute stripe um, detail. Over all over whatever you want to say uh where is this tag sorry i'm just trying to hurry up yes 100 percent linen on the outside and cotton modal on the inside so it's nice and soft little lining so super excited to list this, this these dresses because i've sold this type of dress before from j jill sold really really quick for like 30 dollars. so i'm excited to get this up in for sale. All right, here comes all the jeans that I found. J. Crew, Billy Boot Crop, cute little fringe hem. This is a size 26. I haven't found this brand in a long time, but I, when I found it, the first like two times, it sold really quick and for like 45 bucks. But so I don't know how well these are still selling. Um, AG. I just hear a lot of people complaining about it, but they're cropped. They are called the Layla Cropped Flare Trouser. What size are these? 28 regular. So a good size. So blank NYC flare bell bottoms. Bell bottoms pants. These are 25. Do they have the style of these? No, probably not. Yeah, I don't know what the style is called, but. I'm hoping to get 25, 30 for these because they are pretty cute. All right, my last pair. I've never heard of this brand. I bought these based on style and because I need jeans. This is JBD. And this is, oh, this is by Just Black Denim. Huh. I think that's sold at Lulu's or something. I don't know. These are 29. So I'll probably get like $25 for these, but they are a really cute little style. Little fringe hems down there. So yeah. All right, that's everything. That's my huge Third Off Outlet haul. Let me know what your favorite item was. And if you see anything, feel free to message me over on Instagram, which I'll have linked down below uh, if it, something's not listed right away because, you know, I take my time listing. 
and yeah that is everything and i hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next one